Along the banks of the Ohio River, near the town of Brilliant, Ohio, stands the Cardinal Power Plant. Nestled on 500 acres, the Cardinal Plant safely provides a supply of electric energy and employment opportunities to the upper Ohio Valley. Cardinal's three units have a total generating capacity of 1,830 megawatts, or about enough electricity to provide power to approximately one and a half million homes. The plant is a joint operation between investor-owned American Electric Power and Buckeye Power Company, a member-owned utility composed of Ohio's rural electric cooperatives. Converting coal to electricity involves a series of very complex processes requiring massive equipment, a highly trained workforce, and a variety of technologies. It all begins with the arrival of coal at Cardinal by truck, rail, and barge. Workers test samples of the coal to make sure it meets environmental and product quality standards. A series of conveyors then moves the coal into the plant where it's ground to the consistency of a fine powder. The pulverized coal is mixed with air and blown into a massive steam generator, which stands over 20 stories tall and is suspended from above. The air-coal mixture helps the coal burn more efficiently and at higher temperatures, up to 3,000 degrees. Miles of pipe line the inside of the steam generator. The intense heat turns water inside these pipes into steam. The pipes carry the steam to the blades of a turbine. The force of the steam turns the blades and rotates a shaft. This causes a large electromagnet, located at the other end of the shaft, to spin at an incredible rate of 60 revolutions per second inside a coil of copper wires to produce electricity. This process happens 24 hours a day under the watchful eye of operators in the unit's control room. Operators have extensive training to monitor production and direct workers to check and adjust plant systems as needed. The plant's generators produce electricity at 24,000 to 36,000 volts. Transformers outside the plant increase the voltage to 138,000 or 345,000 volts so it can travel efficiently across transmission lines to substations. Here the power is transformed to a lower voltage for distribution to customers, homes and businesses. Our goal of producing electricity in a way that minimizes environmental impacts meant a large investment in the latest technologies installed at the Cardinal plant. Today, it's equipped with environmental control equipment, including low NOx burners and selective catalytic reduction systems to reduce nitrogen oxide emissions. We also added scrubbers, or flue gas desulfurization systems, that reduce sulfur dioxide emissions. These systems, working in tandem, also help to lower mercury emissions. Cardinal touts a first-in-the-nation technology in its Unit 3 scrubber system. Instead of building a new chimney, the flue gases, primarily water vapor, are released through the cooling tower, the plume of which also is mostly water vapor. This technology increases safety given the existing equipment configuration on the site. Also in Unit 3, water used in the unit's condensers passes through the natural draft cooling tower so it can be recycled. The structure stands 50 stories high with a base larger than a baseball field. It can cool 300,000 gallons of water per minute. Water vapor rises from the top of the cooling tower as cooled water falls to the bottom to be reused. Water isn't the only product that's recycled at Cardinal. We work to improve environmental performance by maximizing efficiency and recycling or eliminating byproducts that come from using coal to generate electricity. Fly ash is a light powdery ash that's captured by the electrostatic precipitator before it can be carried out through the stack with exhaust gases. Bottom ash is heavier and falls to the bottom of the boiler where it is collected. Both fly ash and bottom ash can be recycled for a variety of uses, including construction materials and road base. The plant scrubber operations create yet another product, synthetic gypsum. While this product often is safely disposed of in a landfill, some of Cardinal's gypsum is sold for use by a nearby wallboard facility.
a strong commitment to environmental protection through installation of clean air technologies and recycling efforts is a hallmark of AEP and partner Buckeye Power Company. Beyond our job of producing electricity in a safe and environmentally responsible manner, we strive to be a good community neighbor by providing support for local activities, initiatives, and development programs. But most of all, we are proud to deliver one of life's most essential commodities, safe, reliable electricity.